Hello to my wonderful friends and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going through the unit 2 of your class book. Are you ready? Let's start. Where's my pen? Is the unit 2. So the first question, how many classroom objects can you see? I will let you to scan this image, then answer the questions here. How many balls can you see? What color is the kite? What color is the teddy? Are you ready? Great, so there are one, two, three, four, five balls. And what color is the kite? Yes, it's red. And what color is the teddy? Yes, it's brown. Well done. Next is listen and stick, then listen and say. Okay, this is my bag. This is my book. This is my pencil case. This is my pen. This is my pencil. This is my crayon. This is my ruler. This is my pencil sharpener. This is my eraser. These are my scissors. Now listen and say bag, book, pencil case, pen, pencil, crayon, ruler, pencil sharpener, eraser, scissors. Great. Now for listen and chant. This is my bag. This is my pen, my ruler, my eraser, my pencil case. My things are cool. Now I'm ready for school. These are my books. These are my pencils, my scissors, my crayons, my sharpeners. My things are cool. Now I'm ready for school. Wonderful. Now five, show and say. You can practice with your friend. Tell them, for example, what you have. For example, here, this is my ruler, these are my pencils, and so on. Moving on to watch or listen and read. But before we read, can you tell me how many rulers can you see? Correct, that's three. Now let's start. One, these are my books, and this is Atomic, my cat. Cool. Two, this is my desk, this is my pen, and these are my pencils. Three. What's this? It's my new project. It's a computer, I think. Four. Your books. What a mess. Polly, stop. Oh no. Five. Where is my pen? It's under the desk. Here you are. Let's tidy up. Six. Your crayons your scissors and your rulers thank you seven where is atomic she's under the table look lily eight oh it's a computer it's great well done atomic wonderful now after you read the story look at the story again and read and tick one these are my books two this is my pen. Three, these are my rulers. Well done. Don't forget to act out the story and draw your desk. Moving on to listen and say, then listen and tick. What's missing? Let's read together. Shelf, computer, cupboard, desk, table, chair. Now listen and tick what's missing. Look at my classroom. This is a chair, this is a desk, this is a computer, this is a cupboard, this is a shelf. My classroom is tidy today. Well done. Now to listen and find in activity one, then listen and sing. I'm sure you can sing better than me. Let's try and sing this together. My classroom is tidy, it's tidy today. My classroom is tidy. Hip, hip, hooray. Where's the ruler? It's in the cupboard. Where's the book? It's on the shelf. Where's the chair? It's under the table. Where's the computer? It's on the desk. My classroom is tidy. It's tidy today. My classroom is tidy. Hip, hip, hooray. Well done. Now three, ask and answer. You can practice this with your friend. For example, ask them, where's the pencil case? It's on the table. Here are some examples 
you can ask where is the pencil it's in the desk it's on the desk it's under the desk well done next is listen and draw lines listen carefully and draw lines to these school objects to their proper place are you ready let's go one the bag is under the chair where's the book the book it's in the bag in the bag okay two where is the crayon it's in the pencil case the crayon is in the pencil case okay three where is the eraser it's on the desk okay the eraser is on the desk that's right four where is the ruler it's on the shelf on the shelf that's right five where is the action figure it's on the computer on the computer yes that's right well done number two cut out the listen and play according to the last activity practice with your friend and for example tell them where's the pencil it's on the table what color is it it's pink Woo! moving on to read and match i'm sure this is your favorite task you have text here and school items all you have to do is draw the line to the correct school item so where's crayon correct that's three ruler number two pen correct that's five pencil yes six book correct that's one eraser that's four well done now number two listen and read is it your pen yes it is can i borrow it please yes here you are thank you now three act out the dialogue same as the previous one but use different classroom object you can say for example is it your pencil yes it is can i borrow it please yes here you are thank you and so on next is trace then look and circle but before we go on to the activity i want to clarify there is difference between this is and these are these are uses for two items and more but this is uses for one item only so let's start in number one should we say these are or this is correct this is my pencil what about number two correct these are my erasers three correct these are my pens and the last one four correct this is my computer great now two listen and write yes or no only write yes or no so listen carefully one where is the ruler it's on the desk two where is the sharpener it's on the shelf three where is the bag it's in the cupboard four where's the pencil case it's under the chair one was the ruler on the desk yes number two where's the sharpener on the shelf no three where's the bag was it in the cupboard yes and four where's the pencil case was it under the chair no next look and read put a tick or a cross in the box one this is a table yes it is two these are scissors three this is a book four these are computers yes they are five this is a disc six these are pencil cases yes they are now to point to the pictures in activity one the one we just did and ask and answer practice with your friend do the same thing ask for example what's this it's a chair excellent next is atomics learning club listen and say the listen and number let's read together monster helicopter robot computer book repeat with me monster helicopter robot computer book now listen and number one this is my favorite toy 
It's a robot. It's very small. Two, my favorite toy is a monster. It's very scary. Three, my favorite toy is a helicopter. It's yellow and it's very noisy. Four, my favorite thing isn't a toy. It's my computer. It's very big. Five, this is my favorite book. It's about monsters. It's very interesting. Great, now let's do two. Listen and match. One is already done for you, so the robot is very small. Let's move on to two. The monster is very scary. Three, the helicopter is very noisy. Four, the computer is very big. Five, the book is very interesting. Well done. Now three, say and play. Again, practice this with your friend. For example, say, is it very interesting? No, it isn't. Is it very scary? Yes, it is. Is it a monster? Yes, it is. And so on. Finally, the last page of the unit four, listen and read. What's your favorite book? Jack and the Benstock. It's very scary. What's yours? My favorite book is Cinderella. It's very interesting. Now act out the dialogue, but this time use different books and adjectives. We have these suggestions here. Six, draw a picture of your favorite book, then complete the sentence. I will leave this to you. Finally, I hope you can show what you know now. Right, tick and stick. How many toys words can you say now? Can you talk about your favorite toy? Can you talk about your favorite book? Well done. I hope you learned a lot of things today and had fun. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe the channel.